What is going on guys? Welcome back. We're back with some Q&A from my second round of Instagram story questions. Uh, the first question actually became an entire video on its own talking about supplements. That was my last video. Uh, but now we're getting back into it with three more questions. Uh, so no nonsense, no hesitation. Let's jump in and see what we got. All right, first question. How many days a week do you work out? Great question, love it. So I, on average, work out about six days per week. Um, I always shoot for seven days a week, but usually something comes up. There's one morning where I need to get a little bit more sleep or my work schedule changes. So it, it's on average about six days per week. Um, I don't advise that for everyone. I'm only at that point now after years of training. It used to be more four or five days a week. Uh, but right now there's no excuse for me to not get to the gym six days a week. And I know my body can handle it. That's what I need to, to really keep working towards my goals. Um, right now I'm working with a split routine of chest, then back, then legs, then shoulders, then arms, then another leg workout. So those are my six workouts. I actually have six different days of exercises um, for every time I go to the gym. So that's my routine. It's been my routine for about, I wanna say six months now. Um, I love it. I'm seeing great results. Obviously my bulk's going extremely well. So I'm not gonna be changing anything right away, but I'm sure over time it will adjust a little bit, but I think I'll stick with that number of, of six days per week. All right, let's see, second question. <laughs> okay, this is actually a, a very common one. Uh, how many hours of sleep do you get a night on average? A lot of people are asking me similar questions because uh, you see me, you see my stories on, on Instagram and Snapchat uh, of me being up at 2.30 in the morning. Uh, most every morning, that's really what I shoot for. Um, there are some days when I just can't get up. I, you know, I need a little bit of extra sleep, so I, I will allow myself. I'm not gonna deprive myself from that. Uh, but on average, I would say probably five, five and a half hours of sleep. We'll say five and a half hours of sleep. Um, so ideally it's like 9 p.m. to 2.30. But a lot of days, you know, it, it may be a little bit later than that. And then at least one day a week, I'll sort of make up for it uh, and sleep in a little bit, sleep in until six or whatever. Um, average though is five and a half. And this is another thing I don't necessarily recommend to everyone. I'm not saying it's ideal for everybody, but it's really what I've, I've recognized that it's really what I need to do to get as much accomplished as I want to in a day. Sleep in eight hours, a, a night may be great for some people. Maybe they've convinced themselves that that's what they really need. I don't believe that. I, I think that we can operate on more like six or seven hours of sleep. So I like to push it a little bit further with my five, five and a half. Uh, but there's just so much to do. There's so much life to be lived that I don't want to be sleeping through it. Um, so for a long time now, I haven't been sleeping eight hours a night, uh, but I'm getting down around five, five, five and a half. Uh, and it's working well for me. You know, I. I'm honest with myself. I need a little bit more sleep. Uh, I'm not, you know, doing anything crazy, anything out of my my, you know, ability to to do. I'm just super motivated. I'm, I'm super happy. I can't wait to get out of bed in the morning. Uh, you know, I hate it when I have to go to sleep because there's so much work to be done. There's so many projects. So much excitement. I'm loving life. I'm as happy as I've ever been. So much more happy than I've ever been. Um, so I'm not going to change a thing right now. Okay, let's see, third question, well, third and fourth question, I'm gonna combine them into to one. Um, what's your least favorite muscle to train and what's your most favorite muscle to train? Um, so I would say, starting with the least favorite, honestly, probably back, probably, even though, which is strange because honestly, it's my best body part. It's, it's the, the part of me that's developed the most, it's the most aesthetic. Um, you know, I guess my genetics have sort of allowed for, for a decent back, I, I work, hard i know how to train it properly it's developed you know far beyond most uh, of my other muscles at this point in my my young bodybuilding career uh but it's just never been a fun one for me i love the, the a back pump you know i love walking out of the gym feeling like you know nice and wide like oh i can't fit through the doorway um you know that's fun and all but actually doing the exercises it's never really been a favorite of mine it doesn't mean i slack though you know i still work my butt off um then my favorite muscle probably would be shoulders um, because I've been working on them for so long. It, it's strange how that kind of works out. My best body part is my least favorite and my worst body part for a long time um, is, my, is my most favorite. 
Um, so it's, it's kind of strange how that, that happens that way. Uh, but I've been working my butt off, um, or more accurately working my shoulders off for years now to try to get them broader, to try to get a, you know, square, uh, wider appearance. Uh, cause I, that, that's huge for a classic bodybuilding physique. Um, so I've put in a lot of work, a lot of research, a lot of blood, sweat, and tears, uh, to start making that happen. So I'm proud of it. And now every exercise, every shoulder pump is, is a fun one. Um, I like posting about it on Instagram. You see, I get the, the most excited with my captions on my, my shoulder workouts. Um, but yeah, I'd say least favorite back, most favorite would be shoulders. All right, and that's it. That's three up and three down. I'm trying to keep these videos a little bit shorter. I don't want to ramble on about myself for too long. I want to try to keep it brief and interesting for you guys. Uh, so those were three awesome questions or kind of four awesome questions. Uh, I love it. We're talking about fitness. We're talking about bodybuilding. Great stuff. May have some more uh, personal questions in the next video, uh, but questions of all kinds are welcome. Thank you guys again for your support. Some of you were asking multiple questions, following up from questions from the, the first round. All of it means the world to me. I love you guys so much. I appreciate you so much. Every like, every comment, every subscribe, I, it really does mean so much to me. And I thank you for motivating me to, to keep going with this, to you know helping me to see that I can help people. I can share my knowledge and, and positively influence people because that's all I want. Um, so thank you guys again. Please like, please subscribe, please share it with a friend. Um, you know, make sure you're checking out my Facebook fit tips of the day. Follow me on Snapchat. Um, you know, I'm putting, creating more content there all the time, obviously on Instagram. Uh, you guys are the best though. Uh, just one more time. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.